Alrighty, here we go. Hey there, everybody. It's a nasty one here again, and welcome back to the next episode of the Randomizer franchise rebuild here in Super Mega Baseball 4, year number 3. Last episode for our Thumpers. It was the quarterfinal round of the postseason, as once again the top seed here in the playoff hunt. We ended up sweeping the Bottlenoses out in their playoff debut, winning the scores of 3-1 to one in Game 1 and 3-2 to two in Game 2. And while I am happy that we managed to sweep, I'm worried that the lack of offensive output could spell trouble for us down the road here in the semifinals against a really good trackers club that has made the playoffs the last two years running and were eliminated in the first round last year and now made it to the semis for the first time in the playthrough so yeah i'm kind of hoping we can uh you know, do what we normally do and, you know, beat the drum and hit a lot of home runs, you know. On the other side of the bracket, as you see the Leather Wings, the three seed have taken the win at home, 5-2 to two against the Beast, moving one game away from sweeping their way into the finals. Uh, despite ha not having the rest advantage, the Leather Wings are managing to play through that and have taken the advantage here. We'll see what happens. And here's the matchup for game one of this semifinal matchup against the Trackers on the mound as former Thumpers OG starter Fowler Sandoval. And on the mound for us is rookie Mike Asiago making his postseason debut. Sandoval, as I see, has added a walk-prone tra trait since we last had him. He always had crossed up. He just added walk-prone, it seems. That is a shame. Hey, Scootsy, what's up, buddy? Well, welcome in. Hopefully your day's been well, <laughs> outside of the recording of your last uh, a game of the Discord tournament, unfortunately. <laughs> oh, jeez, that, uh, that is rough. <laughs> I, I completely understand, you know, it's just like it happened out of nowhere. It's like, ugh, why? I thought I was had everything going. <laughs> Lineup for game one here for our Thumpers is Shelton leading off, then it's Rogers at short, Coffee in right, Nomskull at first, Whitehead in left, Flores in the center, Blacksmith at second, McIntosh behind the plate, and Asiago on the mound. And the lineup here for the Trackers, right fielder Sincere Rosario leads it off, followed by on fire left fielder Connor Gilbert. Batting third is center fielder Easton Osborne. Batting fourth is first baseman Abraham Angeles. And then batting fifth is his older sister, shortstop Rosemary Angeles. Batting sixth is third baseman Bingo Rude. Batting seventh, second baseman Hang Anderson. Batting eighth is locked-in catcher Dark Scottish. And batting ninth is the pitcher Sandoval. Let's jump into it and have some fun here. Bing out a bowl. Here we come as we have home field advantage. You could be able to record over it. I'm not sure how that's going to work out because you'll have to uh, import in another audio file over the current game audio file, and you'll have to have a balancer to work that out. That sounds like a lot of complicated stuff, but I think you can do it. Welcome to the opening game of the conference finals. Get on your horse and let's do the baseball thing. Yes, indeed. Let us do the baseball thing, hey? Had to connect to chat real quick. Give me one second. There we go. Yeah, the siblings did make it onto the same team. They had Abraham, I believe, and then they signed Rosemary right before the postseason. I believe that's how that happened. Hey, one boy, welcome in, buddy. Welcome in. Hope your day's been well. And glad to hear the Astros are back. The Orioles apparently can't beat a little uh, minor league team. So, yay us. Uh, it seems we've inherited your bullpen woes from last year. <laughs> Rookie Mike Asiago going to be on the mound here for the Thumpers in Game 1 of this semifinal contest, facing right fielder Sincere Rosario to lead off for the Trackers. Hitting 222 with two RBIs. Mike had a solid rookie campaign. Nothing to write home about, though. Heater up and away. Misses outside on the first pitch. It is ball one. Two-seamer down and away. That's lined at the middle, and that is a base hit. Welcome to the postseason, Rook. Lead off knock for Rosario. No, you beat the Rockies in Mexico. Ah, I see. Well, to be fair, everyone can beat the Rockies. Just not in Mexico City. <laughs> Connor Gilbert up, left fielder on fire, hitting 625 with a homer, six RBIs. How many home runs did you guys hit in that game? Curveball away in the first pitch, runner goes, throw down by McIntosh, just late, it's a stolen base. Rosario moves up on the first pitch steal, and that gives his first of the postseason. He's one for one. Not as much as you should have. Yeah, because I think last year, what was it, like 13 game, thirteen home runs in a single game between both clubs? Something ridiculous like that when the Padres were there. Change it down and in on the next pitch. Hard grounder to second. Blacksmith dives, knocks it down in front of her. Throw to first in time to retire the runner. One down, runner to third on the ground out, though. That is going to put the RBI chance on for short center fielder Easton Osborne. 
hitting 333, no homers and no RBIs on the year. Pushing her way on the first pitch, just off the plate to Osborne, ball one. Well, down the way, grounder to short, right at Rogers, and that's going to get the first run of the game home as that's an RBI ground out for Osborne to shortstop. Trackers up 1-0 in those ugly neon green uniforms. Oh, my God, they look like the swamp thing. Abraham Angeles coming up, the first of the brother-sister duo, batting 500 with an RBI. His older sister, Rosemary, is on deck. Sees him up and away, checks outside at the 31-year-old, ball one. Peter down in the way, hard grounder in the hold of second. Diving his blacksmith off her glove into right field, and that's going to be in a single there as it extends the inning. Good effort, just not fast enough to make that decision. Next up is Rosemary Angeles, the older sister of Abraham. Shortstop hitting 333 with a homer and two RBIs. The 38-year-old getting ready for what could possibly be her last run in the C, last run in the postseason. She is rumored to be possibly retiring at the end of the year with her advanced age. We'll see if she does end up hanging up the cleats or not. She has Mind Gamer active here against the rookie Asiago. Curveball down on the first pitch, misses low, throw down by McIntosh, just laid another stolen base of the inning, second of the inning for the Trackers. Abraham in scoring position, that's his first steal of the postseason as well. Change it down in the way, hard rip foul out of play, one and one. Peter in, high and tight off the plate, two one. Zoom down and in. Slow chopper to short, charging Rogers. Bare hand to first in time, and that ends the inning. But one run home in the RBI ground up by Osborne. Trackers lead 1 0. Bottom one. Shelton, Rogers, and Coffee do up. And to make matters even worse for the Thumpers' offense, uh, despite the lack of productivity, we're also missing Captain Shane Cruz. Tweaked his groin, I believe, or pulled his hamstring. One of the two. Oh, no, he sprained his wrist. He sprained his wrist diving back into second. Bob Shelton up, hitting 143 here in the postseason. That is a one for seven for those keeping track at home. First pitch slayer in contact versus righty active as he will face OG Thumper starter, the original ace of the pitching staff, Fowler Sandoval. Well, Fowler, it's been a long time since I've seen you. <laughs> ace, quotations, yes. <laughs> he was the original best pitcher on the team by overall level. <laughs> Walk prone, he's added that since we last saw him at the end of year one, and uh, he still has crossed up, I see. <laughs> has he regressed much? Yeah, he's only down to a B minus. I believe he was a B plus originally when the series started, so age is showing for the 35 year old. Change up on the first pitch, late swing by Shelton, fouled off, 0 1. Purple hangs on the next pitch, pulled down the right field line into the corner. That's going to get it started. One hopper into the wall. Shelton's going to hold up at first with the singles. That was a good play on the corner carom there by Rosario. That's a leadoff single. Now to bring up rookie shortstop Maya Rogers, who got the playoff started with a bang with the leadoff homer in game one. Her, her home run on the first pitch she saw of her postseason career. But she's been hitless since. She's one for eight here in the series. Slider middle of the zone. Strike call. 0-1. Peter down and then chopper to short. Angeles backhands the second one. Anderson to first double play. Yep. Bingo Coffee up next, hitting 286 with a homer and two RBIs. Batting in the three slot today. Bingo hitting two for seven. Slider in there at the knees. 0 1. Third ball away. That misses. 1 1. Peter up. One hopper up the middle. Short off the diving glove of Rosemary into left center. That is a single. Good effort. Couldn't secure it. It's about single keeps the inning alive for first baseman Kashtan Namskal, who's two for seven here in the postseason. No homers or RBIs. Curveball outside on the first pitch, ball one. Curveball up, strike called with the letters, one one apparently. Heater up hard, rip past the second baseman into right field. Back to back, two out singles here for the Thumpers. We're in business. Two out RBI chance at the plate here for Ramon Whitehead. Hitting only one for six in the postseason. Valtau is active. Let's see if Ramon can come through. Big hit right here would really boost his confidence. No homers, no RBIs. We're going to capitalize. Heater up, chased out of the zone on the first pitch. Foul back out of the zone, out of the play, 0-1. Heater at the knees, pulled to left field. That's another base hit, but right at Connor Gilbert will have to hold. Base is loaded, two down. 
Nowhere to put him. Here comes Chris Flores. Sophomore center fielder hitting two for seven in the postseason. Still without a home runner RBI as well. That is three straight batters in our lineup who've yet to contribute. Let's see if Flores can be the first to break through. Change up in there at the top of the zone, 0-1. Chase the curveball low. Grounder to third. Ringo, bingo root on to first. That ends the inning. Yep, sounds about right. Wasted a golden opportunity to score. To the second. We're down 1 0. Rude, Anderson, and Scottish do up. At least we ran up his pitch count. Bingo Rude up, leading off here in the second. Third baseman is in backup position today. He's normally at shortstop. Batting in the sixth slot. This is his first at bat of the postseason. Curveball down in the way on the first pitch. Strike called. Nice pitch. 0-1. Where's he ripping away? Fouled off. 0-2. Change down and in. Checked low. 1-2. Two seam ripping in. Pulled foul. Out of play. Staying alive there is Bingo. Where's he ripping away? Popped him up. Will it stay in play for McIntosh behind the plate? Yes, it will. She makes the catch. One down. Next up, Hang Anderson, second baseman hitting 300. Three RBIs on the air for the former champ's second baseman. In her first year with the Trackers organization this season, replacing a rusty blacksmith who is standing at second base for us right now. Peter down on the way in the first pitch. That's checked for a strike. Go one. Change up and in. Anderson whiffs on it out in front. 0-2. Oh, two. two seam up and away. Out of the zone. One and two. Well down the way. Chased it in the dirt. Blocked by McIntosh. She'll pick it up and fire to first. Two down. First career postseason punch out for Asiago. Now to bring up catcher locked in Dark Scottish. Hitting 429 with three RBIs on the air. The young 21-year-old catcher. Peter up and in. Takes a strike called at the letters. 0-1. Well down in the way. That's a strike as it floats in there on the corner. 0-2. Change it down and in. Low and inside. Good eye. One, two. Where's he ripping away? Outside. What a take. Two, two. Is he ripping in? Scottish jams it to right field on the line, but right at coffee, and that's a one, two, three inning. Good pitching from Mike. Bottom two. Blacksmith, McIntosh, and Asiago. Bottom of the lineup coming up. Thumpers had four hits in the first inning, but hit into a double play and then stranded the bases loaded with two down. Let's see if we can capitalize this time off Sandoval. Second baseman, Arresti Blacksmith leading off, hitting 167 in the postseason, but she has driven in two of our runs. She is facing her old club for the first time in the postseason. Change up inside, misses off the plate. Ball one on the inside corner. Heater away just outside. 2-0 count. Curveball down, out on the front foot. Liner to center, right at Osborne. One down. Hey, Shanable, welcome in, buddy. Welcome in. Hope that your day's been going well. Jolie McIntosh up next. Rookie catcher hitting two for seven in the postseason. Curveball floats in there. First strike. Oh, one as Sandoval gets ahead. That curveball misses outside this time. One and one. Fastball at the knees. That is skied. Popped shallow center. In on it is Osborne calling off the infielders. He'll put it away. Two down. Base is empty for pitcher rookie Mike Asiago getting his first career postseason at bat. Curveball away in there for a strike from Sandoval, 0-1. That curveball's low and outside, 1-1. Slider middle of the plate, chopped at the middle, past the diving. Angeles into center, that is a base hit. First career postseason hit for Asiago. He'll keep the inning alive with two down. Here's Bobby Shelton. Singled his first at bat and then was immediately erased on a double play ground out. One for one. Contact first righty and first pitch slayer both active for Bob. Curb up and in the first pitch and this time he pulls it again into the right field corner once again. Rosario again plays the carom holding Bob to a single but runners are at the corners with two down. And here is rookie Maya Rogers. She grounded into that double play in the first inning trying to make up for her mistake. Change up down and away, in there at the knees, 0-1. Change up high, off the glove, Asiago's coming home. Scottish is throw to the plate, got him, and that ends the inning. Ballsy move by the rookie to try and score on that. I thought it got far enough away, but he did not. That ends the inning to the third. Sandoval, Rosario, and Gilbert do up.
I appreciate the aggressiveness, Asiago, but at least we did it early in the game and not in a later clutch situation. Fowler Sandoval leading off as it's 9-1-2 and two to up here for the trackers in the third inning. Still a decent hitter. Heater up and in off the plate. Ball one. Well down in the way. That is chopped the third. Bobby Shelton charges. He'll make the play. One down. Next up, Sincere Rosario. He singled, stole a base, and scored a run in the first inning. Two seamer up, misses high. Ball one. Ball down and in. Lined hard to left field. Whitehead there. Two down. Base is empty for Gilbert. He's 0 for 1 with a ground out. Locked in still. He uh, grounded out the second his first time up. He was on fire to start the game. Force him down and then Check swing strike. Go one. Little hack activates here. Max boosted, I might add. Two seamer up and away out of the zone. 1 1. Change it down in the way is outside. 2 1. Where's him up and in? Checked inside. Good eye. 3 1. Well, down in the way. Pulled foul, out of play. Count is full. He's him down and in. Popped him up behind first. Nom skull out and shallow right, calling for it. Cashton puts it away. A 1 2 3 inning for Asiago. Bottom three, it's 1 0. Rogers, coffee, and Nom skull do up. Hard to line up here for the Thumpus. Maya Rogers leading off. Her at bat resets after the wild pitch. Runner thrown out at the plate last inning. Change down and then the first one. Grounded hard under the third baseman's glove. Angeles can't back him up. That is an infield single for Rogers. Her first hit since her first at bat of the postseason. Back in game one against the Bottlenoses. Bingo Coffee up next. He singled his first at bat and was stranded at third base in the first inning. Peter up and away. That's a strike. 0-1. About down and then off the plate. One and one. Change up up. Hard rip past the second baseman into right field. Back to bat, Lee off singles here for the Thumpers. Two on, nobody out, we're in business. Here comes Namskal with RBI Hero. Singled in the first inning and was stranded at second base. Curve up and in, in there for a called strike, 0 1. Slider low, misses to Namskal, 1 1. Peter Middleton turned on by Cashton, hit deep to right center field. Did he get enough of it? Back at the wall, looking up. Beat the drum, it's a home run. It's in the Thumpers' bullpen. Cashton Nomskal cashes that one in as he hits it out. First postseason home run for him. 3-1, the Thumpers take the lead and we have matched our total runs from both of the first two games where we've averaged, we've scored three runs so far in every game this postseason. Let's see if we can beat that number today, folks. <laughs> Whitehead up, he singled his first plate appearance, stranded on the base pass, and here is Sandoval tense now, eh? Curveball hangs high out of the zone, ball one. Slotted down and then is low, 2-0. Change with the knees, pulled foul out of play, 2-1. Change it down, hit at the middle to short, diving Angeles behind the bag. Wild thrower does not activate, but it doesn't matter. Infield single for Whitehead. He is two for two. And that will bring up Flores, who's 0 for 1. Runner goes on the first pitch. Slider up. Misses Ha. It's actually a strike. Throw down to second. Not in time. Stolen base for Ramon as he is in scoring position. Ramon's first steal. He's 1 for 1. 0 1 count to Flores. Heater up chased. Line to first. Picked by Angeles, but we have to freeze. I thought he was going to catch that. Takes it himself to the bag, one down, and that'll bring up a resty blacksmith over one today. Here, change up outside, misses, ball one. Change it, misses, low and away, 2-0 count here to blacksmith. Curve ball in there at the knees, good pitch from Sandoval, I was looking heater, 2-1. Peter down in the way, hit off the end of the bat, knocked down by Sandoval behind the mound. Anderson throws to third. The Whitehead gets back to second safely on the fielder's choice. Everybody's safe. Two on, one down for McIntosh. Let's go, Joe Lee. Got really lucky there. I thought Whitehead was cooked, man. <laughs> Peter away in the first one, hit over second, down for a base hit. 
Whitehead coming around third. He's going to try it. Here's the throw from Rosario. It is cut by Angeles. They've got McIntosh hung up. She's out at first for the second out of the inning, but a run scores. It is four to one. Here comes Asiago, one for one with the single. Can he add on to his team's lead here? Slider from the first pitch, hard grounder to first at Angeles. He'll take it himself to end the inning. To the fourth, it's four to one. Thumpers strike big with the home run from Namskal and then get an RBI single from McIntosh. Four one to the fourth. Osborne and the Angeles siblings up next. Hey, Macho, welcome in, buddy. Welcome in. A few days been going well. Can't stay for the stream. Just wanted to pop in and say good luck. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. Hope you can watch it later then. <laughs> Bad ball hitter active here for Osborne. He has an RBI ground out on his cards today. 0 for 1, though. First pitch curveball down and away. Lined up the middle. That is a base hit. Nice swing. Osborne's first hit. He's 1 for 2. Angeles up. 1 for 1 with a single. Abraham currently locked in. He also stole a bag in his first, uh, ten. first time on the base pass. There we go. Those are words I can use. Two-seamer up on the first pitch. Strike called. 0-1. Down and in. Hard grounder at the middle of the second. Plas Blacksmith in the right center. That's a base hit. Two on. Nobody out. Trackers are threatening to get back in it. Let's see if they can do it. Here comes the older sister of Abraham. It is Rosemary Angeles, the shortstop. 0-1 today. Grounded out to shorter first time up. Change of middle in on the first one. Off the plate. Ball one. Zoom down in the way. That's a strike. One and one. Go down and in. Pop. Foul out of play on that far right side foul territory. One, two, the count. Easy more away. Chased it. Strike three. Second punch out for Asiago. One down. The third baseman, number 29. Bingo. Bingo Root up next. 0 for 1 today. Intense. Struck out swinging his first at bat. You see him ripping away in the first one. That's high. Ball one. We see him ripping in. That's a strike this time. One and one. Come on down in the way. Hit off the end of the bat. Skied right into center at Flores. Makes the catch for the easy second out of the inning. Oh, pff, easy, Rogers. Easy. <laughs> I know you're a little stressed, Ricky, but come on. <laughs> Two down. Here's Hang Anderson over one today. Curveball middle in on the first one is a hanger. Scrack deep to right center field. Did hang get enough? Bingo running out of room at the wall. Puts it away with his back to the mound. Good catch there, Bingo, as he almost runs face first into the fence. We get out of that one, thankfully. Bottom four, it's four to one. Shelton, Rogers, and Coffee coming up. Top the lineup here for the Thumpers in the fourth. Shelton leading off two for two with two singles. Peter middle in, lined hard to center field on the first one, but right at Osborne, one down. Next up is Maya Rogers, rookie single, her last plate appearance, and then scored on a homer. Change ups away outside, ball one. Her ball's away, quickly 2-0. Change up, up, rip to left field, that's a base hit for Rogers, her second of the day. She is two for three, and that'll bring up Coffee. He's two for two with two singles and locked in on top of it. See if Bingo can keep it rolling. Checked high on that heater. Good eye. Ball one. Heater up. Popped him up. Actually, that was middle away. Easy play for Osborne in shallow left center. Makes the catch for the second out. And here comes Kashtan Namskal. Two for two today. Three run homer last him up. He's also singled. Runner goes on the first pitch, heater down and in off the plate. Throw down by Scottish, just in time to get Rogers. Ah, it was worth a shot. Wanted to get RBI Hero active there. To the fifth, it's four to one. Scottish, Sandoval, and Rosario do up. That was uh, Rogers' first stealing attempt for the postseason. She's 0 for 1. Dark Scottish leading off. He's 0 for 1 today with a fly out. Change it down and in on the first one. Chop foul late. A one. Where's he up and away? Popped him up behind the plate. McIntosh out of the crouch. Makes the catch. One down. Next up, Sandoval. He's over one today. 
You see him up and down on the first one. Strike call, 0-1. Change up, up and away. Checked outside, 1-1. One one. Pushing him down and away. Lock, hit hard to first. Diving Nomskal to his left. Cuts it off. Takes it himself. Two down. Nice diving stop. Here comes Rosario, 1-2 with a single. Well down and in on the first one. Low and inside. Ball one. Curveball way outside. 2-0. Change it down in the way. Outside, it's 3-0. Two-seamer up and in. Called a strike, taking all the way Rosario. 3-1. Pushing it down and in. Line to second, right at Blacksmith. That's a 1-2-3 inning for Asiago. He's through the fifth. Bottom five, it's 4-1. Namskal, Whitehead, and Flores coming up. Good pitching, Mike. Good pitching. Let's go offense. Here's Namskal still locked in. At bat restarts. He's got a three-run homer and a single on his line score. Peter away in the first pitch, cracked by Nomskal, left center field. I think he got that one too. Running out of room, beat the drum, it's a home run. This time it's in the Trackers bullpen and left center. As he's hit one to each bullpen today, Kashtan Nomskal doubles up, and that's two homers today. Five won the score. Bumpers extend the lead. Here comes Whitehead, two for two day, two singles. And his stolen bases. That slider's in there at the knees for the first pitch strike. 0 1. Heater up and away out of the zone. 1 1. Way outside on the slider. 2 1. Change of away. Pulled foul out of play. 2 2. Slider hangs. Oh, damn. And Whitehead just died. Or, no, Sandoval just died. My bad. Shit. He just killed a man. <laughs> oh, shit. Poor Fowler. This is just looking like that elite Discord tournament all over again. We just murdered another starter. <laughs> oh, well, sorry, Fowler. I'm sorry it had to be you, buddy. That's going to do it for Fowler. Four plus innings today. He'll leave with a concussion and retrograde amnesia. 14 hits given up. Five earned runs. Coming out of the bullpen is Thaddeus Wallace making his postseason debut. Oh, oh, damn, that came 112 off the bat. Jesus, Ramon. <laughs> How old is Namskal? Good question. I think he's 31? 29, okay. I'm thinking of Abraham Angelis, that's right. Yeah, Namskal's 29. He's going to be 30. This guy is a bounty on those pitches. I do not. That is unconfirmed news. So Greg Williams may or may not be our strength and conditioning coach. That doesn't mean we have bounties on their heads. Chris Flores up. I believe he's 0 for 2 today. First pitch from Wallace. Slider in there at the knees. 0 1. Heater away. Fouled off. <laughs> Keyword unconfirmed. 0 2 count. Heater away. That's fouled off. Out of play. 0 2. Whitehead takes off. Heater up and in. Cracked by Flores to left center field. Carrying well, but he missed it. Back for it there near the warning track is going to be Osborne for the first out. Rowan Whitehead is suddenly going to have a fancy car or a brand new chain around his neck next game. <laughs> hey, I might edit that in. Why not? <laughs> Blacksmith up next. 0 for 2 today. There he goes. Peter up and in. Strike called. Throw down by Scottish is in the dirt. Picked by Anderson, but not in time. Whitehead's second steal of the game. He's 2 for 2. 0 1 count the Blacksmith. Peter up and in. Jammed hard to second on the ground. Anderson throws the third. Not in time. And that's another fielder's choice as Blacksmith just runs it out. <laughs> McIntosh up next, one for two with an RBI single. She was thrown out trying to stretch it into a double. Powerverse left-hander now active for Jolie. Yeah, he's finally showing up, it's perfect. Curveball away outside. I'm surprised he's not locked in though, especially with maxed out volatile. Oh, he is now, perfect. All right, so now we steal. Heater away, that's a strike, one, one. Slider, but then jam shot by McIntosh to right center. Rosario there. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Let's not do that again. <laughs> Tried to get cute with it now. <laughs> two on, one, two down for Asiago. Rookie one for two with a single today. Heater up, strike called, 0-1. Oh, Curveball up, strike called, 0-2. Oh, Runner go. Heater down and then grounded up the middle to Angeles, who charges, fires the first, and that ends the inning. 
All right, one home and another home run by Namskal, and we murder Sandoval as well. 5-1 to the sixth. Gilbert, Osborne, and Angeles coming up. Part of the lineup here for the Trackers against Asiago for the third time. Gilbert up 0 for 2 today and locked in. Asiago trying to get through the sixth. They're in that quality start designation. First pitch curveball down and in. Chased and pulled on the ground past Namskal, who's not a great fielder. That is going to be a leadoff single. Asiago no longer locked in. Namskal was such a huge ad for the playoffs. I wonder if he could be the new quarterstone. He could be. He does bring a lot to the table over uh, Tambor did. So, And, yep, Namskal does sound like a perfect cave, caveman name slash ogre. So <laughs> that actually works out in our favor. Just got to make sure he's not too high priced. Maybe we drop his value down a little bit, bring him back. I think we could work with that. He's already a great offensive threat, and you don't really need a lot of defense at first base, as we've learned. Osborne up. I believe he's one for two. He singled last at bat, if I remember correctly. Change it down in the way in the first pitch. Just outside. No call. Ball one. Peter up and in. Off the plate. Way out of the zone. 2-0. Big hack active for Osborne here. He's him down and in. Low again. 3-0. 3-0 pitch, curveball at the knees. He's swinging, and that was a bad idea to even put that anywhere near the zone as that pops off the top of the fence into the stands for the trackers. Easton Osborne shows why he's S-tier as he lines that piss missile off the top of the fence out into the right center stands. First of the postseason for Easton. It is 5-3. Hey, Scootsy, thanks for the sub. Love it, man. Love it. Appreciate it. Always nice to have a new subscriber. <laughs> Angeles is up next. Abraham's locked in. One for two today with a single and a stolen base, I remember correctly. All right, Mike, this just got a lot harder. So let's see if you can bear down now. You're up in the first pitch. That is cracked. Oh, my God. That was almost back-to-back -back home runs. All right, Mike. This is we, we talked about this, Mike. Come on now. Consistency. Change it down and in. Low and inside. One and one. He's going to up and in. Off the plate. 2 1. He's going up and away. Fouled off. It's 2 2. Hit it down and away. Chop slow roller to second. Blacksmith charges. Bare hands and fires. Got him at first. One down. Next up is his older sister, Rosemary Angeles. 0 for 2. Trying to find her footing here in this series. Ball down and away in the first one. Strike called. Nice pitch. 0 1. He's him down and in. Chopped up the middle to short on the jam shot. Rogers dives to her left, makes the stab, throw to first. Got her! Two down. Next up is Rude. Bingo's open two today and tense. He's him up on the first pitch. Strike called. 0 1. Change it down and away. Grounded to second. Right at Blacksmith. Charging. Throw to first in time. And that finally ends the inning. But a two run homer from Osborne puts the trackers back in it as they cut the lead in half. 5-3 to score to the bottom of the six. Shelton, Rogers, and Coffee coming up. Prime substance, you don't use it on anyone else? Hey, fair enough. I'll take it. <laughs> Thank you. Appreciate it. Bobby Shelton up next, two for three. Two singles today. Lined out the center last at bat facing Wallace. Heater up in the first one. Line hard to center field, and Bobby Shelton got one he could crack at his third hit of the day. He's three for four. Next up, Rogers. Maya, two for four today with two singles. Peter down, line hard to center field. Rogers is trying to get that over Osborne's head. Almost worked on it. That's one out. He managed to run that down at the warning track. Nice hustle. Again, that's why he's S tier. <laughs> you gonna dip? All right, man. Take it easy. Appreciate it. We'll do our best. Thank you. Thanks for coming in and subscribing, buddy. Catch you later. Bingo Coffee up next. One for, uh, what, two for three today, Bingo? Peter the knees, hard of the ground, at the middle of the short, picked by Angelese. Oh, my God, the wild thrower activated on the flip to second. Oh, my God, I've never seen that. She dirted the relay flip to second so they don't get the out at second, and instead he had to pivot and throw it to first. They get the out there, two down, runners in scoring position. Namskal is RBI hero. He's already homered twice today and driven in four runs. Uh, 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 cashed in, just cash in. 
Oh, that was the pitch to strike the letters on the heater, 0-1. Checked away on the heater. Good eye, 1-1. One one. <laughs> I'm so glad you saw that, too. Uh, heater up and in. Oh, right at Anderson. That ends the inning. Unlucky. Although we did get to see something magical happen, and that's what matters. We got to see a unicorn. To the seventh, it's 5-3. to three. Anderson, Scottish, and Wallace, bottom of the lineup, coming up. Asiago's going to start the inning. We'll see how this goes. Now back. Baseman, Anderson up 0 for 2 today. Anderson. All right, buddy. See you next time. Hopefully we can carry through. First pitch curveball down and into Anderson is off the plate inside. Ball one. Where's he moving in? Off the plate. 2-0. Change it down in the way. Chopper in the hole to first. Namskull over on the backhand. Flips to Asiago in time. One down. Next up is Dark Scottish. Catcher 0 for 2 today, but locked in. He's him ripping in on the first one. Check strike. 0 1. Where's him ripping away? Outside. 1 and 1. Well, down in the way. Rip the third on the line right at Bobby Shelton. Two down. Pitcher Thaddeus Wallace threw up next. He's pitched really solidly since taking over for the injured Sandoval. But they're probably going to pinch it for him here, and they do. And here is backup shortstop Blaze Todd, who probably was the primary shortstop for most of the season. <laughs> Let's be real here. Got screwed over because they wanted to get the Angelis siblings connection in the lineup. So as a B plus, he's on the bench. First pitch change it down. Chased out below the knees. Fouled back. 0-1. Zimmer up and in. High to Todd. 1-1. One, one. Where's him down in the way? Outside. 2-1. Double ball down. Sky to center field, hit pretty well. Flores on the run in front of the warning track and right center puts it away, and that's going to be a 1-2-3 inning for Asiago to end his day. Seven quality innings for the rookie. Nice pitch in, Mikey. Nice pitching. Whitehead, Flores, and Blacksmith do up. Godfrey Morris has taken over on the mound here for the trackers, facing Whitehead, who's 3-for-3 three three today with three singles and two stolen bases. He is locked in. Morris has yet to pitch in the postseason as well, I believe. He has not. Yes. No trades for him either. Heater away in the first one. Late swing there from Moore, uh, from Whitehead, 0-1. Heater away is outside, 1-1. One one. Heater away, cracked by Whitehead to right field on the line, but right at Rosario, one down. Next up is Flores, 0-3 for three today. Heater down in the way, taking low, ball one. Curve up and away, chopped hard to short, right at Rosemary. Throw on to her brother in time, two down. Base is empty for Blacksmith, 0 for 3 today. Heater up and away, late swing on the change curve. Yeah, that's a two-seamer actually, or er, late on it, 0-1. Curve ball down, blooped over short, and sometimes that's all you need, a little blooper. That drops in. Blacksmith is first hit of the day, she's 1 for 4. Two out knock, keeps the inning alive here for McIntosh, 1 for 3 with an RBI single. Heater up, taken high, ball one. Blacksmith takes off on the next pitch, slider inside, misses, throw down by Scottish, not in time. Blacksmith steals second. Ooh, that's her second steal of the postseason. It is, she's two for two. 2-0 two count to McIntosh. Curve off the way, gets in there at the top of the zone, 2-1. Heater down, popped her up right in front of the mound. Therefore, it is going to be Morris to end the inning. To the eighth, it's 5-3. Rosario, Gilbert, and Osborne top of the lineup coming up for the trackers. Asiago done after seven quality innings. Gives up three runs on six hits, one homer. No walks and strikes out two. Not a bad debut, rookie. You're in line for the win. I'm going to go ahead and double switch here. Uh, hmm. Flores ain't done much today. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I think we're going to get a little risk. Flores hasn't done much, that's true. Neither is McIntosh, but I don't have another catcher. Cruz is injured. We could take out Blacksmith. She didn't do much today either, but she's a really good fielder. E and I need to double switch because Asiago's due up first next inning. We are going to need to double switch here. There's no doubt about it. It's going to be a double switch. Who are we going to turn it over to? Hmm. Choker's active for Valenzuela. That's probably a no from me. He's also got the least amount of rest in the bullpen here. 
Could give it to Concentrado, but it's a close game. I want to avoid giving it to her if at all possible. Pruitt's kind of the de facto closer. Uh, we're going to go ahead and give it to Celeste Pruitt. She's going to try and slam the door the rest of the way. We will be taking out Chris Flores, and we will be putting in rookie Arnold Liu to play right field. Moving into, actually, he'll be in left field. Moving to center will be Ramon Whitehead. Ramon has better speed. <laughs> Uh, so Pruitt has pitched in both of our postseason games so far this season. No record, a 675 ERA and an 075 whip. Two appearances, two saves, one earned run, inning in a third, one hit, and a 200 batting average against. Let's go. Max boosted volatile behind Pruitt here. There's pitch curveball down in the way, misses low, ball one. Change of hangs down the middle. Oh, he missed it, thank Christ. That was a mistake pitch, one and one. Not going to get too many of them past uh, Rosario here. Peter up and in. High out of the zone. 2 1. Peter down in the way. Chased and fouled back. We're up 2 2. Tough out activates. Go down and in. Low. 3 2. Change it down in the way. Fouled off. Counts full. There's him down in the way. Blew it by him. Strike three. First punch out for Pruitt. One down. It's our first postseason punch out this season. Here's Gilbert. 1 3 with a single and locked in. Peter up on the first one, way high, ball one. Slow it down, Celeste, slow it down. Change it down and in. That's a strike, one and one. Ball down on the way. Grounded hard to second, Blacksmith to her right, backhands cleanly, throw to first, two down. Base is empty for Osborne. Two run homer last at bat, he's also got an RBI ground at and a single. Scriven in all three of their runs. Bad ball hitter is active. Change it down and in on the first one. Out in front of it on the big whiff, 0-1. Oh, down in the way. Hard grounder past Bobby Shelton at third on the dive. That is a two-out knock. Osborne is on here with his third hit of the day. Bringing up Angeles. Abraham two for three with two singles today. First pitch curveball down and in from Pruitt. Check strike, 0-1. Oh, of course, he's ripping away. Chase blooped off the end of the bat to right field. Coffee racing in. Slides. He does not get there. Picks it on a hop, and that is down. Runners at the corners. Tying runs on base with two down for Abraham's older sister, Rosemary. Can she deliver with her first hit today? She's 0 for 3. And pressure building here for Pruitt. Boy, seamer up and away in the first pitch. Popped her up behind the plate. McIntosh out of the crouch. Puts it away, and we get out of the jam. Bottom eight, it's five to three. Lou, Shelton, and Rogers coming up. There's Arnold Lou, the rookie, leading off the inning. Looking for his first career postseason hit. Heater up and in, that's a strike. Go one as Morris gets ahead. Heater up, chase, blooped over third, but foul. Out of the diving reach of Rude, 0-2. Way up and in on the heater, almost hits Arnold, 1-2. Peter up, lined into center field, and that is the first career postseason hit for Arnold Lou as he drives that one in. Over the second base bag, in for a single. Lead off man on for Bobby Shelton, three for four today with three singles. He lined out last time up. Come on, Bobby. Or, no, he lined out the time before that. Slide at the knees, roped by Shelton to deep right center field on the first pitch hanger. One hop into the fence out there as Osborne gives chase. Osborne gets it into the relay man. Coming around third is Lou. He's going to try and score. Anderson throws the third to keep Shelton at second on the double. Thumpers get an insurance run. It is six to three. Maya Rogers up next. Two for four today with two singles. Rookie trying to come through. Slider down and then nips the corner. Nice pitch, Morris. So one. What was I swinging at? Chase the two seamer way out of the zone. 0 2. Heater down the middle, turned on by Rogers, but out in front of it. That had home run distance, 0-2. Heater away, crushed by Rogers to the gap, right center field. That's trying to split him. Rosario on the run, gets there for the first out. Shelton was halfway, he'll retreat to second. One down for Bingo Coffee, two for four, two singles today. Bingo looking for his third hit. Curveball put away, just hits the top corner of the zone, 0-1. Oh, 
Heater down the way, hit up the middle, past Anderson into right of center. That's down for a hit. Shelton around third. He is going to score. RBI knock for Coffee. It's 7 to 3. Another insurance run for the Thumpers. <laughs> Man, indeed. <laughs> Cashton Namskal up next. Uh, grounded out last time up. He is 3 for 4 today, though, with two homers, driving in four runs and a single. Heater inside almost hits him. Okay, Morris. All right. You're getting a little chippy out there. Coffee takes off. Heater up and in is inside again. 2 0. Throw down. Not in time. Bingo's first steal. He's one for one. Today, anyway. Two for two in the postseason. And now RBI hero active for Namsko, and I bet you he's willing to chomp at the bit at this next pitch because Morris almost hit him earlier. 2 0 count. Check curveball down and in low. 3 0. Namskal, if you get a hanger, you have my permission to swing 3-0. Pick off the second, not in time. He's delaying the inevitable. And also, he's missed all three pitches inside. I think he is sending a message, or attempting to. Heater up and away, not a hanger, but that'll drop in the left field for a base hit. Coffee around third will hold. Runners at the corners, one down. Here's Whitehead, three for four, three singles, and the uh, tracker's manager wisely removes Morris from the game. Coming out of the bullpen, long reliever Kaysen Vu making his postseason debut. We'll have K-Collector active in two, out, two strike counts. Change up inside, ripped foul on the first, 101. Runner goes at first, heater down in the way, dumped over first, that is down for a base hit. Noms go around second, heading for third, he'll move up on the hit and run, it's 8-3 as Whitehead drives in his first run of the game. That was his fourth hit, and here's Pruitt. Celeste with a five-run lead. Just go ahead and hit, girl. Or, you know what? Actually, how you have the bullpen. I don't need to waste you here, Celeste. Why don't we go ahead and pinch hit? Give me Eden Kliffenstein. <laughs> Hitless in the postseason, but max boosted pinch perfect. Come on, Eden. Change it down and then rip foul. 0-1. Slider chase low, dribbled in the hole to first. Angelis flips to the bag in time. RBI ground out for clip, it's 9-3. Runner at second, two down for Blacksmith. One for four with a single. Heat up and away is chase, grounded in the hole to second. Anderson to first, that finally ends the inning. But the Thumpers add on four insurance runs here. 9-3 now the score. Klippenstein will remain in the game at second base as we will go ahead and bring in Kenley Concentrato with a big lead as Blacksmith will exit. Top nine, it is 9-3. We got a six-run advantage. Rude, Anderson, and Scottish do up. Now batting, the third base Tracker's looking to get a rally going. Tense 0 for 3, Bingo Rude leading off, facing Kenley Concentrato, the 34-year-old veteran with reverse splits. Meter up and away on the first one, out of the zone, ball one. Her ball away. Crack deep to center field, hit pretty well. Whitehead on the run. There in front of the warning track, puts it away, one down. Next up, Hang Anderson, 0 for 3 today. Reverse splits act for Concentrato. Heater up and away, taken high. Ball one. Two seamer inside, misses, 2 0. Throw ball down, misses low, 3 0. Two seamer up at the top of the zone. Anderson swings, misses, pulls a foul, 3 1. Four seamer away. Hard rip foul, still full. We're seeing the middle in. Check swing, strike three called. First punch up for Concentrato, two down. Base is empty for Scottish, 0 for 3. He's the last chance for the trackers today. Curve ball down and away. Outside, ball one. Peter up and away. Fouled off, out of play, 1-1. One, one. We're seeing the middle in. Grounded to short right at Rogers. Throw across the first, 1-2-3, ninth inning for Concentrato. Thumpers win game one, easily 9-3 as the offense finally showed up today. All right. Good offensive performance. We had 21 hits and we scored nine times. Could not ask for more than that. Uh, RBIs today, three for Easton Osborne. He drove in all of their runs, two on a homer and one on an RBI ground out. He did have three hits. Same with Abraham Angeles behind him. He also had three hits. But after Angeles, everyone else in the batting order got no hits. All their hits were between their top four hitters. My God. 
On the other side for us, two home runs today for Cashton Nomskals. He's the big man on campus, driving in four runs. One for Bingo Coffee on a single. Sheldon had an RBI single. Whitehead had an RBI single. Klippenstein had an RBI ground out. And McIntosh had an RBI single as well. Pitching lines, Sandoval takes the loss, four plus innings, 14 hits, five earned runs, two homers, a line drive to the face, retrograde concussion, and amnesia. 0 for 1 now after facing his old club, two scoreless innings from Thaddeus Wallace. Uh, Godfrey Morris gave up four earned runs in an inning and a third and almost got thrown out of the game. And Vu, two-thirds of an inning to slam the door. For us, Mike Asiago in his postseason debut got the quality start. Seven innings, three earned runs on six hits, one homer, two strikeouts. He improves to 1-0. and uh, Pruitt, an inning in relief of him for the hold, two hits and a strikeout. And then Concentrado gets a hold with one inning, one strikeout in the ninth. Nomskal, four for five days, the player of the game with two homers, driving in four, followed by Osborne driving in three, and then Bobby Shelton with a four-hit day to start the top of the lineup. He also drove in a run as well. GG's for game one. We're up 1-0, looking for the sweep. All right, let's see if the Leather Wings can take care of business and sweep the Night Bats, or will the Night Bats pull the upset? Let's find out. Or it's not the Night Bats, is it? No, it's the Beast, that's right. Leather Wings beat the Night Bats in round one. All right, Beasts are going to be at home. They're going to try and force game three, and they lose 2-1 to one in a pitcher's duel. Leatherwings have swept. They will be making their first finals appearance here in the series. Leatherwings, of course, made the playoffs back in year one when were eliminated in the first round. Beasts, once again, they fall just short. Beasts have made the playoffs all three years, but they've been eliminated in the first round two times, and then this time they made it to the semis and lost. We're looking for the sweep. Here we go. Pitching matchup. It is a battle of the Aces, I believe. Let me check that real quick. Yes, battle of the Aces. Greshi and Harris for us. 1 0 with a 150 ERA and an 083 whip. And on the mound for the Trackers, Sonny Boone. No record of 360 ERA and a 140 whip. He is K Collector. Ooh, okay. Lineup we'll use for game two looks like this. Leading off will be Shelton at third. Then it's locked in coffee and right. Cruz is back in the lineup at catcher, despite still being injured. I kind of want McIntosh in there, even though we're not facing a lefty. So go ahead and take a day off. Shano will keep you in mind as a pinch hitter late, maybe. Uh, Namskal will be in there uh, batting fourth. He's locked in at first. And Whitehead batting fifth, locked in and left. Rogers batting sixth at shortstop. Blacksmith batting seventh at second base. And tenth, Chris Flores will be in center field batting eighth. I actually want to move this around. I want Whitehead to move up to third. I want Nomskal to be fourth. Then it can be McIntosh, then Rogers, then Blacksmith, and then Flores. Lineup for the trackers. It'll be Ange Rosemary Angelou's tense at shortstop, followed by Gilbert locked in and left. Osborne in center. Angel Abraham Angelou's locked in at first. Rosario in right. Anderson tense at second base. Rake Rilo will be making his series debut at third base today. Getting the start over Bingo Rude and batting eighth will be locked in catcher again, Dark Scottish, with Boone on the mound batting nine. Let's jump into it and have some fun here. Heading to State Royale for game two. Got to remember that deep right center area here at State Royale. It almost functions as a triples alley, really. Bumpers looking for the sweep. Trackers looking to force game three with the victory. <clears throat> All righty, here we go. Game two coming at you. Bobby Shelton leading off today, 417 batting average, one RBI. Contact for Reddy and first pitch slayer both active against Sonny Boone. Sonny in his first postseason start, no record, a 360 ERA and a 140 whip. Two earned runs given up in one start, five innings pitched, five hits surrendered, two walks, five strikeouts, and a batting average against of 263. Let's see how he deals with Bob. Will he throw him a pitch on the first one to hit? Yes, he will, and I'm out in front of the slider. A bad swing. 0 1. In, down and in, strike called. 0 2. Curble down, hit at the middle of the short. Off the diving glove of Angeles into left center. It's a base hit. Bob Shelton again picks up where he left off. Remember, he had four hits in the first game. Lead off man on for Bingo Coffee, who's locked in, hitting 4 17 with a homer and three RBIs. Change of up, misses high, ball one. 
Change of up at the top of the zone. Line to right field. Down in front of Rosario for a base hit. First and second now. Nobody out. And here comes Ramon Whitehead. Ramon locked in with four hits in the first game, hitting 455 with an RBI. He's also killed a pitcher with a line drive to the face and driven in a run in the first game. Heater away, that's a strike, 0-1. Oh, Heater up, cracked line to center field hard, but right at Osborne, one down. Basically, Osborne just managed to run a circle there in the outfield before making the catch. Cash the noms go up next, locked in. He had two homers in the first game, driving in four runs. He also has RBI hero active again. Let's see if he can come through. Change up and away out of the zone. Good eye. Ball one. Heater up and in. Line hard to center field. That is in for a base hit. Shelton comes to third, but Osborne already has the ball halfway into the mound. Will hold. Base is loaded, one down. Here's catcher rookie Jolie McIntosh hitting 273 with an RBI. She had one hit in the first game, which was an RBI single. Heater down. This is low from Boone. Ball one. Heater middle in line, hard to short, but right at Rosemary for the second out as everybody's safe. Next up, Maya Rogers, shortstop hitting 231 with a solo homer and an R bag way back in the first game of the postseason. Two hits last game. Trying to come through with the base loaded here and two down. Heater in there at the knees on the first one, 01. Throw ball away in there for a called strike, it's 02. Okay, collector activates for Boone. Heater up and away, hit up the first base line right at Abraham Angelis, who takes it himself. And that ends the inning as we once again strand the bases loaded in the first right. inning. Seems to be a theme today. <laughs> Bottom one, Angeles, Gilbert, and Osborne do up. But when we did it in the first game, we ended up winning and scoring nine runs. I'll take it as a good omen sign. You get a nice view of the rainbow out there in the outfield. Here's Rosemary Angeles, outfield sky, I should say. Locked in, hitless in the first game, 0 for 4. Hitting 231 with a homer, two RBIs facing our ace, Greshian Harris. Greshian in the postseason got a victory his first go around. Six quality innings, giving up one earned run. 150 ERA and an 083 whip. Four hits given up, nine strikeouts and a walk. Batting average against 182. Mind Gamer active for Rosemary here. Cutter up and in. High. Ball one. Peter Mill to the plate. Hard grounder to short right at Rogers. Maya makes the play. One down. Gilbert up next. He's locked in. Left fielder hitting 500 with the homers. Six RBIs. Right up and away in the first one. Ripped foul out of play. 0-1 as little hack activates. Change but way, way outside. 1-1. One one. Works in the middle in. Jam foul. 1-2. and two. Little hack active again here. You see him up and in. The cutter up and in. Fouled off. Chased at 1-2. Side down in the way. Checked low. 2-2. Two, two. Little hack now gone for Gilbert. Where's he up and away? Foul off, 2-2. Two -two. Change down and in. Line at the middle, that is a base hit. A knock here for Connor Gilbert as he's on for the trackers. Next up going to be Easton Osborne. The center field drove in all three of the trackers' runs in game one. He had a two-run homer and an RBI ground out in that contest. I believe he also had three hits. First pitch slider down and in. Line to second, right at Blacksmith. Two down. Base is empty. For, uh, runner at first, two down for Abraham Angeles. First baseman locked in. Ace exterminator active here, hitting 583 with an RBI. We're seeing up and away in the first one. Strike call, 0 1. Change it down and in. Chased it low at end, 0 2. Slide it down in the way. Chased it, strike three. First punch out for Harris. That ends the inning. Nice pitching, Greshian. To the second, we're scoreless. Blacksmith, Flores, and Harris. Bottom of the lineup up to the Thumbers. Second baseman, Arresty Blacksmith, leading off, hitting a buck 82 in the postseason. Two RBIs. She had one hit in game one today. First pitch heater in there at the letters from Boone, 0 1. Peter down is Chase, Nubber to short. Angelis to her left, makes the play, one down. Next up, Chris Flores, center fielder, hitless in the first game. He is tense, hitting 182. 
Or ball away, strike called, 0-1. You're up away, popped him up, right center, shallow. Osborne in, calling for it. Puts it away, two down. Base is empty for Gresham Harris, pitcher locked in, hitting 500 in the postseason. Change it down and then pulled foul out of play, 0-1. Peter up, chased at 0-2. Okay, collector activates for Boone. Peter up, line to left center field. On the run, though, is Gilbert. He gets there. 1-2-3 inning here for Boone. Bottom two, it's scoreless. Rosario, Anderson, and Rilo do up. I believe that's how you say it. It's either Rilo or Rillo. We'll see. Here's Sincere Rosario, right fielder, hitting 231 with two RBIs here in the postseason. Cutter up and away in the first one, out of the zone, ball one. Slide it down and then from Harris, strike call, one and one. Force him down in the way, blew it by him, one, two. Tough out now, activates here for Rosario. Change bumping in, pulled foul out of play, count remains one, two. Force him up and away, chased it, strike three, back-to-back -back Ks for Harris. One down, next up is Anderson. Second baseman tense hitting 214. Three RBIs on the postseason for Hang. Force him down in the way. Whiffed on at 01. Cut her down and in. Chop the second. Blacksmith charges. Makes the play to first. Two down. Next up. Rake Rilo, okay. Hitting 250, no homers, no RBIs on the year for the third baseman. Getting the start today over Bingo Rude, who went hitless in the first game. Change up and away in the first pitch. Outside, ball one. Four seamer up and in. High, 2 0. Cut her away, outside, 3 0. Slider middle in. Check swing strike, 3 1. Cut her up and away. Line foul out of play. Counts full. Change up and in. Chased and fouled off. Still full. Taking it down in the way. Lined off the end of the bat to short. Picked by Rogers on a hop. On the backhand. Throw to first. 1 2 3 inning here for Harris. Top three. It's scoreless. Shelton, Coffee, and Whitehead coming up. Let's go offense. This is the inning where it started last time. Bobby Shelton leading off one for him with a single today. Change up, up and in, strike called, 0 1. Change up away, grounded second. Right at Anderson, one down. Next up, Bingo Coffee, one for him with a single today, but lines and locked in. Get her down and in, strike called, 0 1. Slider misses low, 1 and 1. Curveball up. High. 2-1. Good eye, bingo. Change it down. Ooh, out in front of it. 2-2. Two, two. Okay, collector activates for Boone. Slide it down. Line to the left center. That is down for a base hit. Nice job, bingo. Way to dump that in. His second hit. He's 2-2. Two two. Here's Ramon Whitehead. Over one today, but locked in. Curveball away. Outside. Ball one. Pick off the first, back safely. Curve ball misses low, 2 0. Pick off the first, back safely again. 2 0 still the count. Side up and in, high, ball three. Heater away, late swing, 3 1. Curveball up, misses ball four. That is a five pitch walk to Ramon. Two on, one out, and here's Namskal. RBI hero active again, locked in. One for one with a single. Come on, cash then. Let's cash one in, buddy. Change up inside, off the catcher's glove. Both runners try to advance. Throw to third by Scottish, not in time. Everybody advances on the, wild, on the pass ball. Infield now in for the trackers. 1 0 count here to Namskal. Peter away is outside. 2-0 count from Boone. For a ball misses low, it's 3-0. Cashton, you have the green light if it's down the middle. 
Heater up, line in the left center field. He got one to hit, and that's going to roll all the way to the fence. Cashton's going to cash them both in. It's 2 nothing on the double. And those are his fifth and sixth RBIs here in this series alone. Rookie catcher Jolie McIntosh up next, 0 for 1 today, trying to bust out of her slump. Change away, strike call, 0 1. Nice pitch, boom. Heater down, misses low, 1 and 1. Change up up, cracked by McIntosh to deep left of center. Back for it, Osborne to make the catch for the second out. Tagging will be Nom's call as he advances to third. Two down, runner 90 feet away for Rogers, rookie 0 for 1. Curveball down and in, low and inside, ball one. Good eye there. Curveball up and in, inside, strike call, 1 and 1. Change it down and in, low and inside, 2 1. Slider up, misses high. It's 3-1 now. Slider up, hit to the gap right center field. Rogers is going to get it done. That's going to roll all the way to the fence and cash one in. 3 nothing now, Thumper's lead as Rogers runs into second with a stand-up double. Second postseason RBI now for Rogers. Here's Blacksmith, over one today, trying to bust out of her slump now. Boone now tense after giving up two runs in the inning. Or three runs, heater misses low, ball one. Heater up and in inside, 2-0. Slider up high, 3-0. Check low in the heater, ball four. Second walk today for Boone. Two on, two down for Flores. 0 for 1, trying to bust out of his slump now. He's tense. Curveball up in there at the top of the zone, 0-1. Curveball misses low in the dirt. Good block by the catcher, 1-1. Curveball away, pulled on the ground, a short hard, diving Angelis to make the stop. Throw across the first, not in time. Infield single for Flores. Bases loaded for Harris. Pitcher looking to bust it open, he's 0 for 1. Will he help his own cause here? Heater up in the first one, dumped into center field on the soft liner. That's down for a hit. One run's going to score, second runner's going to try it. Throw coming to the plate is cut by Angelis. Throw to second, and the third run scores as well. It's a three-run single for Harris. He got his job done and extended the inning on the hit and run. We busted open for six runs in the third. Bottom three, six-nil to score. Scottish Boone and Angeles do up. There we go, offense. Now we're awake. Now we run in it. There's Dark Scottish catcher leading off the third inning. Eight, nine, and one here for the trackers. Scottish hitting 273 with three RBIs. He's no longer locked in after a wild pitch pass ball in the second inning, or last inning, actually. Harris locked in. Peter up and away. Foul back. It's 0-1. Change it down and in. Whiffed on it, 0-2. Cutter in. Chase, jam shot behind second on the pop-up. Blacksmith there. One down. Next up, Sonny Boone, pitcher tense, hitting 500 in the postseason. Slider down and away in the first one. Strike called, 0 1. Boys are up and away. Whiffed on it, 0 2. Cut her down and in. Grounded the first one hopper. Nom Skull there, takes it himself, 2 down. Base simp for Angeles, tense, 0 for 1. Cut her up and away in the first one, out of the zone, ball 1. Goes me down and away. Fouled off. 1-1. One one. Slider up and in. Off the plate inside. 2-1. Into the knees. Out in front of it. 2-2. Two, two. Change it down. Taken low. 3-2. Goes up and away. Line to left center. Whitehead on the run. Going after it. Lays out. Nice diving catch by Ramon. That takes away extra bases in the gap. 1-2-3 inning for Harris as we tip the cap to Ramon. To the fourth, it's 6-0. Shelton, Coffee, and Whitehead do up. Shelton leading off, one for two with a single. Let's see if we can keep it rolling, guys. Peter, middle of the plate on the first pitch. Cracked by Bob Shelton, left of center, carrying well. Beat the drum, it's a home run. He got a center cut fastball, puts it in the tracker's bullpen, and we get on the board again. It is seven to nothing.
first of the postseason for Bobby. Bingo Coffee up next, two for two with two singles. He's locked in, and that will do it for Sonny Boone as the ace will leave rattled. Three plus innings today, seven earned runs. He didn't take a line drive to the face, but he sure feels like it. Coming out of the bullpen, long reliever Dolly McGribbins, one of the few relievers here for the Trackers who did not pitch in game one. McGribbins 1-0, a 225 ERA, and a 050 whip, one earned run, one appearance, four innings, two hits, four strikeouts, one homer, and a batting average against a 143 trying to stop the bleeding. Pardon me, Jesus. Coffee up to 2 for 2 today. Change from side off the plate. Ball one. Good eye. Change with the knees. Pulled by Coffee down the right field line. That had the distance, but out in front of it. 1 1. Slide it down. Line to center field. That's down for a base hit. Bingo on with his third hit today, I believe. Nobody out still. Here's Whitehead over one with a walk last plate appearance. Locked in. Now pick officer is active, so we will no longer be running, unfortunately. At least not until McGribbins is out of the lineup. And we're also up seven runs. That'd be kind of rude. <laughs> Change it down in the way. Strike called with the knees. 0-1. Peter in. Lined under the glove of McGribbins. No play at second. We'll take the out of first on the fielder's choice. One down. Here's Nomskal. Two for two. Two run. Double last time up. He's also singled. RBI hero active. Still locked in. Peter Benin jam shot the left field. That is down for a base hit. Coming around third and holding his boss, uh, coffee. First and third, one down. McIntosh up next. Texture, catcher's 10, so for two today. We can come through here. Peter Way lined at the middle, base hit. Nice swing, Jolie. RBI single, 8 nothing thumpers. She gets back to neutral with that swing. Here's Rogers, 1 for 2 with an RBI double. Last time up for the rookie. Change of up. Ooh, got me out in front of that one. Good pitch. Oh, one. Get her down. Hit hard at the middle off the back of the mound. That's a base hit. Runner comes to third. We will hold. Base is loaded. One down. Thumpers looking to add on here. Here's Blacksmith, the one with a walk last plate appearance. Change of up, misses high and away. Ball one. Here, but in hard shot, but a short diving. Angeles make the stop. Flip the second one on the first lead. Fielder's choice. Nine nothing. Trackers RBI there for Blacksmith. Here's Flores, one for two with a single. McGribbins now tense. Heater up hard, rip through the middle, another base hit for Flores. He'll drive in another run. It is 10 nothing Thumpers. Keep it rolling, baby, keep it rolling. Here's Harris, one for two with a three-run single last time up. Got caught trying to extend it into a double, but he kept the run down alive long enough to get all three runs home. Locked in. Heater up and in, chopper to second, slow roller. Anderson to first. Finally, the inning is over. Thumpers, though, add on four more runs. 10 nothing to the bottom of the fourth. Gilbert, Osborne, and Angelese coming up. Gilbert leading off, one form of the single. He's locked in. Slider middle in, off the plate. Ball one. Goes him at the knees. Chop foul, one on one. Cut her down and in. Low and inside, two one. Change up and away. Foul back, 2 2. We're seeing weapon in. Jam shot the left field. Whitehead coming in. Slides. Makes that catch again. One down. Another good gold glove play there from Whitehead. Here comes Osborne. 0 for 1. Cut her down in the way in the first pitch. Strike call. 0 1. Change up. Check strike. 0 2. We're seeing weapon ease. Line in the right of center. That's going to be down for a hit. Osborne on with a one out knock here in the fourth for the Trackers. Angelie is up next. Abraham over one today. What they six terminator active though. RBI, he's locked in. Got her pin in on the first one. Jam shot out the middle of the short. Rogers dives out of her reach. It's a base hit. First and second now with one down. Trackers are threatening here. Let's see if they can get on the board. Here's Rosario, 0 for 1. 
Change of play, outside, ball one. Come down and then, grounded hard to short, Rodgers is there, flips the second one, Blacksmith the first, double play, you love to see it. That ends the inning to the fifth, we get out of the jam, Shelton, Coffee, and Whitehead coming up. Shelton leading off two for three, solo homer in the single today. The Gribben still tense from last inning. Change it down and in, off the plate on the first pitch, ball one. Change it down as Chase, sky to left of center. In on it, Osborne, one down. Next up, Bingo Coffee, three for three today with three singles. Peter down in the way, cracked the left of center, hit pretty well. Racing in is Osborne for the second out. Next up is Whitehead, 0 for 2 with a walk. Peter up and in, strike call, 0 1. Peter away, cracked by Whitehead off the end of the bat. On the fly, though, is Osborne. 1 2 3 inning. Bottom five, we're halfway home. It is 10 to nothing. And you know what that means. If after the sixth or seventh inning, we're up by 10, I'm going to do seven since the postseason. We're up by 10, or more. if we're up by a big margin, we send the last two innings. Anderson up both one today and tense. Peter down in the way in the first one. Check swing strike. Go one. Down and in. Chase, Nubber in front of the mound. Harris off. Bare hands to first. Pull one down. Next up is Rilo, Rilo, 0 for 1 today. Number seven, Rank Rilo. Cutter been in on the first one. Chased inside, 0 1. Rally starter active here for Rilo. Lighter away. Checked outside. Strike call, 0 2. Push him down and in. Chased it, strike three. Third punch out for Harris. Two down. They sent for Scottish, 0 for 1 today. Cutter up on the first pitch. Fouled off, 0 1. Rosie Miller away. Whiffed on at 0 2. Edge down the way. Chased it, strike three. Back to back K's for Harris to end the inning. He's at four now today to the sixth, 10 0 the score. Namskal, McIntosh, and Rogers coming up. Here's Namskal, 3 for 3 today. Doubled single twice and driven in two runs. He's locked in here. Slider been in, taken high. Ball one. Good eye there, Cashton. Change up inside, strike call, 1 and 1. Slider down, misses low, 2 1. Change the middle in, ripped foul, 2 2. Change down and then way out in front of it, 2 2. Peter up and in, pulled to right field on the sky ball. Right at Rosario, one down. Next up, McIntosh, 1 for 3 with an RBI single today. Change it down, strike call, 0 1. We're wearing our home jerseys. Oh no. Heater up, misses high, 1 and 1. Don't know why I just thought about that. Heater down in the way, whiffed on in late, 1 2. Slider away, hit off the end of the bat to left of center. On the run over is uh, Osborne. Two down. Base empty for Rogers, 2 for 3 with an RBI double and a single today. Heater away, late swing, fouled off, 0-1. Heater down, hard grounder in the hole to short, backhanded by Angeles, throw to first. 1-2-3 inning here for McRibbons. Bottom six, it's 10-0. McRibbons, Angeles, and Gilbert do up. McRibbons do the lead off, pinch hitting for her is center fielder Thomas Guzman. He will replace the pitcher on the pinch hit opportunity. Change down and in on the first one. Inside off the plate. Ball one. Better up high. 2 0. Rushing down in the way. Check swing strike. 2 1. Side up and in. Whiffed on it. 2 2. Change down and in. Chase number back up the mound. Harris is there. Flips the Nomskull in time. One down. Good recovery. Almost a little bit of miscommunication there. Here's Angelese 0 for 2 intense. Put her away on the first pitch. Strike call, 0-1. Pushing him up and in. Blooper behind third. Rogers over, makes the catch. Two down. They sent for Gilbert, 1-2 with single. Slide it down in the way. Off the plate, ball one. Pushing him up and away. Strike call, 1-1. One one. Change it down in the way. 
Grounded to third. Bobby Shelton there. Throw across the first. Another one, two, three inning here for Harris. He is through six with the quality start so far and a shutout. Moore is coming out of the bullpen here for his second straight appearance. Out of the bullpen, he threw an inning in the third in game one of this series, giving him four and runs. The 7 8 9 do up here for the Thumpers as Blacksmith, Flores, and Harris up. Blacksmith over two today with a walk and an RBI on a ground out, I believe. We're going to go ahead and pinch it for her. Coming off the bench, Eden Klippenstein taking over. Pinch perfect active, hitless in the postseason, but she did drive in a run on an RBI ground out in the first game this episode, facing the tense Morris. Heat her way, hard grounder at the middle of the short, diving Angelese to her left. Throw to first, in time, one down. Flores up, two for three, two singles today with a single and an RBI. Heater inside, off the plate, ball one. Slider hangs, skied off the end of the bat to right of center. Air forward is Osborne, that's the easy second out of the inning. Here's Harris, one for three with the three run single. Pitch counts at 68, he's got one more inning in the tank. Go ahead and bat Harris. Slider hangs, out in front of it, 0-1 on the rip. Chase the low on the two-seamer, 0-2. Heater up and in, jam shot on the ground to second. Anderson there, one, two, three inning. Bottom seven, it's still 10 nothing. Osborne, Angeles, and Rosario do up. There's Osborne, one through the single, or one through the single. Klippenstein remains in the game in second after pinch hitting. Pushing it down and in. Chopped the short. Rogers over to her left, cuts it off. Throw to first, one down. Abraham Angeles up next, one, two of the single. Ace exterminator still active. Where's he in? Hi, I want to know. Get down in the way. Pulled foul out of play. 1-1. One, one. Cut it down. Chased it low. 1-2. and Cut it from the way. Line to short. Rogers over. Backhands. Throw to first. Two down. Base sent for Rosario. Over two today. Cut it from the way. Hi, ball one. Into the way. Check the strike called. One and one. Let's see him in. Blooper to right field shallow. Coffee races in. Puts it away. Another one, two, three inning for Harris. A shutout through seven. To the eighth. It's ten nothing still. Shelton, Coffee, and Whitehead coming up. Here's Bob Shelton, two for four. Solo homer and a single today against now facing Morris for the first time today. Chase one low on the first pitch. Dribbler to second. Anderson bare hands the first, one down. Coffee up next, three for four day with three singles. Heater weighs outside, ball one. Chased it down and in on the heater, bad swing, one and one. Changed down, pulled foul, one and two. Curve ball down, this is low, two two. Chased it inside, fouled off again on the heater, two two. Heater up and in, blooper out over second, over the leaping glove of Anderson, it's a base hit. Fourth hit today for Bingo, he's on with one down in the eighth. And here comes Whitehead, over through the walk today, but locked in. Slider hangs, turned on by Whitehead, deep to left center field, he got a hanger, he made him pay, beat the drum, it's a home run in the stands over the bullpens. May it break it open even further now for the Thumpers offense, it is 12 to nothing. First home in the postseason for Whitehead. Next up, Namskal, three for four, double two singles, two RBIs, and now do it for Morris. Coming out of the bullpen is the other reliever we did not see in the first game, Jeffrey Compton. Compton in the postseason, no record, a 338 ERA and 150 whip, one appearance, one earned run given up, two and two-thirds innings, three hits, one walk, one strikeout, and a batting average against a 273. Heater inside off the plate, the Dom Skull, ball one. Out in front of the changeup away, early swing, one and one. Change the knees, turned on by Dom Skull, line drive deep to left field, piss missile incoming, beat the drum, it's a home run. Dom Skull hits his third homer of the episode, first today's game, and it is now 12, no, 13 nothing, as that is his third homer of the postseason. There's McIntosh, one for the RBI single intense. Pinch hitting for her is the captain, Shane Cruz, will take over behind the plate. Still recovering from a sprained wrist, but he's well enough to hit. 
batting 1,000 here in the postseason with an RBI driven in. Mind Gamer also active here against Compton. Beat it down and then sky ball to left center. Coming in for it is going to be Gilbert. Two down. Next up, Rogers. Two four RBI double and a single today. Change of hangs. Pulled foul early 0-1. Peter down on the way outside, 1-1. One one. Curveball misses low, 2-1. Curveball in there at the knees, nice pitch, 2-2. Two -two. Curveball away, blooper to left field off the end of the bat, sinking quickly into the sliding glove of Gilbert, and that robs a hit. Bottom eight, though, we get three more runs, 13-0. Now the score, Anderson, Rilo, and Scottage do up. There's Anderson, 0-2 today, but tense. Cruz remains in the game, a catcher after pinch hitting. Peter away, strike called, 0-1. Fire middle in, ripped down the right field line, out of play, it's 0-2. James Buffett in, fouled off, still 0-2. Harris on fire here. Cutter down in the way, off the plate, 1-2. Listen down and in. Checked inside, 2-2. Two -two. Slider up and away. Fouled off, still 2-2. Two -two. Cutter down and in. Off the plate, full count. Where's he up and in? Hit deep to right field. Running back is Coffee to the fence. Leaps at the wall into that little armpit section. It's a home run. Thought it was a little more to the left than it was. First homer of the year, postseason for Anderson. Trackers on the board, it's 13 to one. They will not get shut out. Rilo up next 0 for two today. Good double switch here, we really could. Yeah, we'll leave Harrison, why not? Peter down and in on the first pitch, check swing strike, Oh one. one Rally starter still active for Rilo, slider down on the way, off the plate, one and one. Cut up and away. Popped him up over the screen. One, two. Look up and in. Jam foul behind the plate. One and two. Where's him down the way? Chased it. Strike three. Fifth punch out for Harris. One down. Next up, Scottish. Over two today. Ladder hangs on the first pitch. Pulled foul out of play. Got lucky. 0 oh, 1. Get up and in. Jam shot into center. That is down for a base hit. Scottish on with the one out knock. Now to bring in the pitcher, Jeffrey Compton. Hit this in the postseason. Finch hitting for him is Trip Harper, former False Knights first baseman. Or no, I'm thinking Trevor Hendricks. My bad. Never mind. Ignore that. Heater up and in on the first pitch. High. Ball one. And down the way, chopped at the middle. That is a seeing eye knock into center field, and that is going to do it for Harris's day. He's going to go seven and a third innings today, folks. One earned run given up. Both runners on base. His responsibility, though, here. He gives up a total of six hits, no walks, and strikes out five. Not a bad outing, Harris. Going to go ahead and double switch here. Coming in out of the bullpen, we're going to hand it over here to Stu Chang, the long reliever, as we will take uh, Rogers out. We will bring in outfielder Arnold Liu. He will play left field as Whitehead will play shortstop, the utility player. Chang in the postseason, no record, a 0 ERA and an 0 50 whip. One appearance, two innings pitched, one hit, four strikeouts, and bang average against a 143. Now pitching, Stu Chang. First pitch four seamer up and in, off the plate, ball one. Two on one down here for the trackers. Slide it down in the way, strike call, one on one. Change with the knees. Hard grounder to second, right at Klippenstein. Flip to second. One, Whitehead to first. Double play. You love to see it. And that ends the inning. Coming out of the bullpen, long reliever, Kaysen Vu, as he'll take over on the mound. Vu through two thirds of an inning last game, giving up no runs. Top nine, we're up 12. Klippenstein leads off 0 for 1 today. Peter up and in, strike called 0 1. Slider low, misses 1 1. 
Get it down, and then blooper to right field. Jam shot in on it on the sliding glove. Rosario, he can't make the catch. It's down for a hit. Kleppenstein's first hit of the postseason. She's on. Lead off the ninth. Here's Flores. Two for four, two singles, and an RBI today. Feed her down. Chopper up the middle of the short. Angelis there. Flips the second one. Anderson onto the other. Angelis in time. Two down. Next up is Arnold Liu, batting 500. Rookie got his first career postseason hit in game one. Flores once again tense. Change of a ways outside. Ball one. Slider away. Sky ball off the end of the bat to right center. Out for it, Anderson. She is there, and that ends the inning. Bottom nine, it's 13 to 1. Gilbert, Osborne, and Angelese do up. It's Chang looking to slam the door and put us in the finals for the third straight year to start the series. Gilbert leading off, one for three with a single. Slide it down and then. Chopper slow over to first. Nomskal charges, takes it himself, one down. Next up, Osborne, one for three with a single. Where's him away? Strike call, no one. Change down and in. Chopper back to the mound. Chang off. Bare hands to first. Two down. Trackers down to the last chance in the series. It's Abraham Angeles. One for three with a single. Change book away in the first one. Strike call. 0 one. Slide it down in the way. Grounded a third. Bob Shelton charges. Throw across the first. One, two, three, ninth inning for Stu Chang. Thumpers blow out the trackers in game two. 13 to one. We have a date with the Leather Wings in the final as both teams sweep their opposition here today, advancing with a max boost in stamina and rest for everybody involved. We love to see that. Offense, uh, we blew them out again. 18 to their six hits, and we scored 13 times, but they only scored once. Home runs today. Bobby Shelton had a solo shot. Ramon Whitehead had a two-run homer. Namskal had a, uh, I believe it was a solo homer. He also doubled home two. McIntosh, an RBI single. Rogers, an RBI double. Blacksmith, an RBI, I believe, on a ground out. Uh, Flores, one RBI on a single. And uh, Gresham Harris, a three-run single as well to help his own cause. On the other side for the trackers, only six hits today. One run driven in on the home run by Hang Anderson. Pitching lines, Harris, seven and a third. Quality start for the ace, six hits, one and run, five strikeouts, one homer. He improves to two and oh. Stu Chang inning in two thirds, scoreless to get the hold in relief. On the other side, Sonny Boone takes the loss, three innings, nine hits, seven earned runs, two walks, one homer. He falls to 0 and 1. McRibbon's three innings, giving up three hits on five, three runs on five hits. Morris inning in a third, two earned runs, giving up on a homer, two of the two hits as well. Compton, two thirds of an inning, giving up one hit, which was a homer and an earned run. And Vu, an inning clean with one hit given up. Another victory in the books. Cashton Nomskal, the player of the game. He was a triple shy of the cycle. Driving in three runs. Harris, seven and a third innings, is the runner-up for his pitching. And, that, and Ramon White has third place finisher with his two-run homer. Not bad at all, guys. We're back and we're into the finals. Here we go again. We already know who we're facing. It's going to be the Leather Wings. We will have home field advantage. We are the number one seed in our conference. And on the other side, they were the three seed. So that automatically defaults to us. As the uh, highest seeded team remaining. Alrighty, that means we have home field advantage. On the mound for the Leather Wings in game one will be Rebecca Radical. While we will have Sawyer Radical. No relation. Lineup will look like this. Leading off at third, Bobby Shelton. Batting second, locked in and right, Bingo Coffee. Batting third is catcher Shane Cruz. Batting fourth, locked in first baseman, Cashton Nomskal. Batting fifth, locked in left fielder, Ramon Whitehead. Batting sixth, shortstop, Maya Rogers. Batting seventh, second baseman, Aresti Blacksmith. Batting eighth, center fielder, Chris Flores. He is tenth. Batting number nine is Sawyer Radical. That will be for next time out. As Radical Radical will be the matchup on the mound for game one. And that'll do it for this episode, guys. Big wins today for the Thumpers uh, team as we managed to blow out the Trackers 9-3 to in Game 1 and even more so in Game 2, 13-1 to as we advance to the Finals where we will try and secure our third straight title here to begin the season. Uh, if you made it this deep, guys, thanks so much for sticking around. I appreciate the support as always. If you haven't already, hit the follow and or subscribe buttons down below here on Twitch to be notified next time I go live. And if you haven't already over on YouTube, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe to the channel. Link to Twitch will be down in the description below if you guys want to come over and watch the games live before they're posted. And also follow me over on this platform as well if you so choose. 
Catch you on the next episode, everybody. Until then, this is The Nasty One, signing off. Have a wonderful day, evening, or afternoon, wherever you guys may be.